Artemis, Humanity's Return to the Moon After more than 50 years, humanity is finally returning to the moon. NASA's Artemis program is preparing to send astronauts back to the lunar surface, paving the way for long-term exploration and even future missions to Mars. But how will they do it? What makes Artemis different? Let's dive in. The Apollo missions ended in the 1970s, but our fascination with the moon never faded. Artemis is different, this time, it's not just about visiting, it's about staying. NASA, along with international partners, aims to establish a sustainable human presence on the moon, leveraging lunar resources and setting the stage for deep space exploration. To make this mission possible, NASA has built cutting-edge technology. The Space Launch System, SLS, the most powerful rocket ever, will carry astronauts aboard the Orion spacecraft. New lunar landers, like SpaceX's Starship, will enable surface exploration, while the Lunar Gateway, a mini-space station orbiting the Moon, will serve as a hub for future missions. Artemis I has already launched successfully, testing the capabilities of the Orion spacecraft. Artemis II will take astronauts around the Moon in preparation for Artemis III, the mission that will finally land humans on the lunar surface again. The goal? Long-term lunar living and, eventually, sending humans to Mars. The Artemis program is more than just another space mission, it's the beginning of a new era. The Moon is just the start. Are we ready for the future of space exploration? Let me know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more space content.